What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Critical Oblo here. So we're going to be talking about Saw X in this video here today. This will be my last Saw X video I do before my review that's going to be up on Thursday night. So we got a new clip of the film. It looks like this is Mateo's trap and we got our first reactions about the film online since the social embargo has lifted and it looks like obviously and i say the word obviously in the sense of with a lot of the new releases the first reactions have come out and to no one's surprise probably they're seemingly very positive calling this series a return to form i'm going to go over those reactions but before i get to that i want to share my thoughts on this clip we got of mateo in his trap now what i will say about the clip is that i love how it's capturing the aesthetic of the saw of old and looking like it's of course trying to bring it back to its glory days but with a more updated take on it since we're of course not in the 2000s anymore we're in the early 2020s and it looks like this is the first time we'll get to see billy the puppet because billy the puppet makes a grand entrance here bringing mateo the tools he'll need for his little game he's about to play with a tape right behind him on the tray of medical tools that Mateo actually has no idea what they are, which I thought was a nice detail that really will speak to just how scammy or scummy, I should say, and conniving these con artists are and how deeply involved in this charade he seems to be if you don't even know what these medical tools are on the on the uh, on the tray that Billy the Puppet is bringing to him. Uh, the clip ends with him playing his playing his tape and we don't really get to hear much of the dialogue other than hello Mateo and I'm, I'm certain we'll hear I want to play a game but the clip itself short to the point very creepy uh, I love the editing in the sequence as well although there was a lot of cuts felt justified didn't feel like it was just cutting for the sake of cutting and now I'm going to lean into these initial reactions that have come out for the film so over on Twitter the reactions to Saw X have come out and they again are very glowing. One of the first reactions here says that I am so freaking happy to say that Saw X rules so hard, y'all. Tobin and Shawnee are amazing and there's a lot of heart to the horror here. The traps are gleefully gory. One in particular may have ruined my life. I absolutely loved it so much. Full review tomorrow in reference to the fact that like I've been stating, if you follow me on social media, the full and full review embargo will lift tomorrow on Wednesday at 11 p.m. Eastern. So this person, Heather, Heatherface, also did state that this was the first Saw film to make them cry. So I am very inclined to see what moment it was because we do see glimpses in the trailers and the TV spots and the clips that have been coming out of what looks like John hugging someone. So I'm certain it's going to get very emotional at some point, given what we all know he is dealing with and why he is doing what he's doing or what has pushed him to that point. Uh, another person here says Saw X is bound is bound hands down one of the best in the franchise putting john kramer center stage more than ever works brilliantly and tobin bell slays amanda's return is executed brilliantly and the traps are amongst some of the best even when quite simple plus the story is and they gave two thumbs up Someone else goes on to say, this is Shannabelle come home. Now that the social embargo has lifted, I'm happy to announce that Saw X is one of the best additions to the franchise. It brings back the original essence of the first film, while also allowing the audience to gain deeper insight into Kramer. Plus, the traps are chef kiss. One other reaction here. I got to see Saw X, and it was the first Saw movie I've seen. Tobin Bell really is something in this role, and I can see why interest dwindles without him and he's in this a lot i think the fans will like it but will it convert a new one i'm still on the fence then from joe blow here our own zombie victim caught saw x in vegas last week and had a bloody good time with it he calls it a return to form for the series with shawnee smith stealing the show as amanda that's not to discredit tobin bell who gives his best jigsaw performance yet now the sheer mention of tobin bell giving his best jigsaw performance yet is what really got me intrigued we knew that this is going to lean heavily into being a john kramer centric story that's what we've been hearing about from the very beginning even before production started so getting to see tobin bell shine and have a more prominent role in terms of diving deeper into john i can see why that would lend to tobin having his best outing as john kramer tobin bell is an outstanding actor can't take that away from him I do think that these reactions are going to line up with how I'll end up feeling with the movie by the time I see it. 
obviously i'll have cons like what i like i do with any movie i'm sure a lot of you will have cons some of you probably are looking at these reactions and going oh well this is just typical what else is new because again everything new lately that comes out and maybe for the longest time it's always positive first reactions right away always man well i take that back <laughs> i just recalled pet cemetery bloodlines which releases on paramount plus next weekend that had its first reactions come online you guys if you saw my review you know how i felt that actually got panned so i'm gonna give saw x credit i do think that these first reactions are going to line up with how i end up feeling about the movie how i think the movie is executed and i think a lot of you will be in agreement with the first reactions as well when you see it later this week i don't know what day any of you plan to see it some of you have let me know you plan to see it friday but i don't know what day the vast majority of you will be seeing it so let me know down below in the comment sections when you will be checking out saw x this week i again will be seeing it on thursday did not get invited to any type of early screenings those mostly seem to be reserved for new york and la and i don't live in either of those locations so i will see it on thursday i'll have a spoiler review up on the channel this thursday night that's coming and if there's room for me to do a spoiler review maybe i'll do a spoiler review i have a lot of things coming my way that has me pretty backed up and staying busy with some reviews and other things i need to catch up on regarding the channels other stuff i just want to do on the channel in general but let me know down in the comment section below what do you guys think about these early reactions to saw x what were your thoughts on that clip and again keep in mind do stay around after the credits or after the credits begin to roll there's apparently either a post credit scene or a mid credit scene or there's actually both and i do know who at least one of the individuals are that are going to appear somebody that a lot of you will be pleased with hopefully their usage is something that can please everyone who goes out and sees the movie this weekend but again let me know what you guys think about this down in the comment section below if you haven't already of course make sure you go ahead and subscribe turn on post notifications so that you never miss a video in the description i'll have links to my social media accounts i'm on facebook twitter and instagram you can message me there of course let me know any movies news or reviews i'm going to cover in the future and with all that in mind guys i will see you in the next video